the awareness focuses on educating young people and the community about the legal consequences of unlawful behaviors, illicit drug and alcohol possession and consumption. Waigane District Court Senior Magistrate Albert Daniels highlighted the growing concern of illegal drug smuggling, consumption of ombru and other criminal behaviors among the youths. He said the penalty for possessing and selling of illicit drug is 20 to 40 years imprisonment, which comes with a huge amount of fine, and the community should be aware of this. Carabus in Wamplaman, all in drug law, 30 years Carabus. Now, no popendata, Wamplaman and Kissim, Carabus law, dangerous drugs law, all in Tassol, you know, make all the something, all in Tassol, look out in the skin, look at 20 years Carabus. Me ask him you, you youth or you papa or mama or you boss blo idua or usat, bo, uh, boss blo company, you got 40 years karabus, lo give him lo gaman, sit down nothing lo biru na stop, me no think plenty, me no ka just like in time lo give him lo gaman, lo stop nothing lo one plus correctional service institute. Magistrate Daniels further called for collective responsibility from youths and community leaders to work towards addressing these serious issues. He encourages everyone to abide by the rules and laws in place. This is the same thing that I'm talking to you. You may come up with them. Look at God and what they do. Now you are in Buddha. Hey, how you may eat? Time you may not abide the law, what they order, the law, this law. You may come up with them, what they say, look at God. So Parliament must make him not a black wolf again. He must have him this law. The campaign encouraged the youth to avoid unlawful activities and contribute to build a safer environment for everyone. This program was made possible by the Law and Justice Department in collaboration with local authorities, which they intend to continue these outreach in the coming weeks, targeting key areas in the province to ensure that the message reaches as many people as possible. Lauren Jamal, National MTV News.